oh, 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 oh. It's going to be a rock, paper, shoe war between Arapaima and rock, paper, scissors. Gucci Raw fam. So guys, today we are going to be building the most epic spin the wheel YouTube has literally ever seen. Amir, what's up? What's, what's up, Blake? Guys, if you guys don't know, it's my brother, my, my blood brother. <laughs> Blake's exotic animal range. How you doing, bro, bro? Chilling, chilling, chilling another day. Chilling. So of course, guys, I'm here with my brother, and you know, this is Blake's exotic animal range. For those of you guys that haven't checked out his channel, you, you good, bro? You good, fam? Guys, he has a massive barn with millions of animals. Guys, it's really cool. But, you know, on that note, animals is exactly what we're gonna be spinning for. But uh, first, bro, where's the wheel? And, bro, we, we, we gotta build this gotta thing, build right? Yeah, so, gotta... so today, I thought it'd be fun, because you've always seen those people, like, yeah, 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 they just have a, a wheel, they spin it, and it's boring. So, of course, Raw fam, we are going to be making the most epic spin the wheel, literally, I have ever done. And it actually is right over here. So, guys, we were just, you know, just at Blake's house today, and I, and I like, looked over, I was like, Hey, f hey, fam! What is that? And that would be this, bro. What, what the heck is this, bro? That's the best thing we ever. This is like a, um, this is like a tractor tire. Look, look at this. Oh my! I just put a little piece of wood in there. We're good. Hey, oh my! Hey, hey, bro. Are, are you subscribed? You, you good, fam? So of course, this is really heavy. Here you go. Hey. Oh, bro, you good, fam? Yeah. All right. So we're gonna get like a little thing to go in the middle. Then we're going to decorate this up, yeah, and definitely. we are going to turn this thing in into a bad of the bone wheel right now so let's do it bro we could literally like stick this into the thing all right, all right Blake, just break roll that over here all right I got let's you. just roll that down get, get a good look at the oh there you go oh 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 you good so we're gonna stick it right here are you ready uh just just like this okay all right all right all right you got it three two one spin that wheel boy Oh, oh my gosh. Bro, that is the coolest wheel ever. So on that note, anything that this wheel actually lands on is going to be the animal that we pick. So obviously if it lands directly on Arapaima, then we're getting an Arapaima, but we want to, you know, switch this up. We want this to be really fun and, you know, actually like awesome. So obviously if the wheel spins and lands on a blank space, it's going to be a rock, paper, shoe war between Arapaima and Clown Knife between me and Blake. Rock, paper. Paper, scissors, shoe. I obviously represent clown knife. Bam! Now we are getting a clown knife if this was a real That's how the spin. Game's gonna go. All right, I got this. You got it? You got, got it? This. So, of course, let the games begin. Uh, 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 uh. Oh! Guys, it hit a blank space. So, obviously, you guys know what that means. So, obviously, Blake is on tarpon side. So, if he wins rock, paper, scissors, shoe, I have to get a tarpon. But, you know, hopefully, if I win, yeah, we winning. get a red tail right there. So, guys, let the rock, paper, shoe begin. Rock, paper, <laughs> <laughs> rock, paper, scissors, shoe. Oh, no, you no. win. Oh, wait, but Got it's, still, it. it's still a tarpon, Indo that's tarpon. That's, that's still awesome. really cool. Hey, All right, bro. Let's do so, it. of course, guys, we have to go off and get an Indo tarpon. This was totally cool. We spun this wheel. Yeah. Oh, now we got to wait for the wheel to stop spinning. <laughs> One second. I land on it. Oh, there you go. Yo, mama. What? <laughs> I don't know what the heck yo mama was supposed to mean, but everything else on the board was legit. We had um, flag tail, tail, we had a clown knife, arapami. It's kind of hard to read upside down. Perune shark, stingray. Oh, bro, should we spin again? These are some pretty cool names. But of course, guys, no, we are not spinning again. The rules are the rules. And they're set. It's time to go off and get an Indo tarpon. When we shot this video, we had all of the, the places that we could buy all these animals at. What? Where was the Indo tarpon? I believe predatory fin, right? Most likely. I, I think so. All right, yeah. guys. So we're gonna get. What the heck is that? You're at the ranch, bro. It gets loud out here. Uh, <laughs> it's definitely getting loud. And of course, it's time to get out of here. Go to predatory fin and buy this tarpon. <laughs> It was Gucci Raw fam. So guys, we just got over to Predatory Finn. We are obviously walking in right now, and um, th this is this is this is an amazing video. I, I promise you that. So we did a little shebang, and obviously, we're, we're picking up a tarpon. Um, hello. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, guys. So this little buddy is like is like right there. Hi, bud. And uh, we're actually picking him up right now. It's gonna be awesome. So let's do it.
fam. So we just got back to obviously the Rolf fam and we have these boxes. We have a bunch of fish in here. I'm gonna actually unbox these guys. Um, we don't have much time. It's almost dark um, but guys I'm gonna try and uh, see if we can get you the best footage possible so I'm gonna pass it over to my new camera girl <laughs> you good okay okay I'm gonna let me help her out let me help her out so we obviously just need to get these out of the truck first before we can move them all right that's one two three that's four. All right, Royal Fam, so we do obviously have, you know, our four boxes right here. We have a bunch of crazy beautiful fish in there. Um, a couple things that I didn't show you guys, a couple things I did show you guys, but um, let me see what's in this one. Come here, ready? Oh, bro, look at that. You know what that is? Bro, that's a big fish. We're gonna get these guys over to this pond as quick as possible. Um, I wish I could just like shortcut it right there, but I think I need a wheelbarrow because these things are heavy. So wait right there. I'll be right back. Uh. Beautiful. Huh? All right, guys. So down here, as you guys can see, we have our tarpons. These are Indos. These are freaking beautiful fish. Whoa, hey, babies. What's up, Mr. Tarpons? So we're just going to put these guys right in there. Look at them, they're already, they're already flipping out. Oh. Alright, come here. These guys are really cool. These are like little pikes. Very, very, very cool. Very aggressive, and we got a lot of them, so they're really cool. All right, Raw fam, so we have these three different boxes right here. They all have different, really, really, really unique, cool fish, but over here, come, come, come on, come on. Over at this pond right here are our Indo tarpons. They're very beautiful. Hey, guys. Let's roll this bad boy up, and They're still a type of tarpon, so you gotta be very careful with them. I don't really wanna hold them. Very delicate fish. Don't need that anymore. All right guys, so now what I gotta do, I gotta take that waterfall, turn it back on because obviously these tarpon need some oxygen, so. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hey tarpons. Welcome to the Raw Fam. All right, Raw Fam. So this is actually a sock net for koi. It's actually a Matsuda sock net for koi, imported from Japan. This is one of the best koi nets in the world. They don't help me out. That's just I'm stating fact. I like getting these wet before I use them. For these fish, they're too big to acclimate. There's not that much of a of a temperature difference. You see that guy right there? His head's going in. Relax. Ready? That right there is the proper way to transport a fish. From the best people in the business, that fish did not suffer. That fish is now swimming with my other monsters. How cool is that? We're gonna do the same thing with this guy right here because these are the most delicate fish that I probably own. Stick his head into there. Soak up as much water as you can at first. Then this is a strainer at the bottom. Turn this so the fish can't go anywhere. Strain out the water. Now you're not cross-contaminating near as much. Then go like this, get the water going. But obviously guys, those were some pretty beautiful fish. Um, what we're gonna do is get these last couple of fish that are in here, out from in here, right there. Tomorrow I'm gonna go off and feed everything inside this pond on camera for you guys. So we're gonna be doing money challenges, we're gonna be doing our awesome epic raw fan videos, but I still wanna keep you guys intact with what animals I have at my facility because we're gonna be posting 24 videos a month. That is five videos a week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I love your raw fam. Guys, big thing is coming here for the raw fam. That pond's gonna be set up very soon. The pond behind you guys is looking beautiful and I'm also buying a house very soon, so woo, it's gonna be big. With fish this small, you could 100% pick them up by hand. I deal with a lot of koi, so this is gonna be quite easy. 
That's how that would look, but I don't want to do that. This sock net is much better. Those fish have spine. Koi do not have near as many spines. Um, that's why I'm not going to run with this fish. When you deal with as many fish as I deal with, you can be quick with it. And Rolf fam, I think it's about time to wrap this video up. Oh yeah, Rolf fam, and don't forget, I did not forget about this Lego pump.